marijuana can be a gold mine. That's what I've been told. Okay, folks, so my home, my state of residency is in a non-legal state for marijuana, so I can't purport to be the world's expert on this, but I am a businessman and a certified public accountant, so I can tell you a little bit about you know, the accounting side of things and the tax side of things when it comes to the business of marijuana. I am in a national group of small business accountants, and so we have seen this issue come up in other states, in legal states. Back in the tech boom of the early 2000s, it was thought that, you know, business was unending, an unending supply of money. And, you know, with this newer industry unseen, we're starting to see that, well, it, there is a bigger drain on this than people had previously thought. The thing about this industry is there's a lot of extra costs that people just hadn't anticipated. For example, it's extremely heavy tax at the local level, very heavily taxed at the state level, and you do have to pay tax, federal tax, on your profit, even if it's federally illegal. Now, interesting sideline here, and maybe one of you who are in legal adopting states can address this, especially if you're qualified in that you know the tax laws or you're in the business. Just like the technology boom, these companies could be losing money for a year or two or three. It could be an unending um, line of losses and how long can an industry sustain that? I guess just like the boom in any new industry, we just have to wait and see and find out what happens. And maybe if you're the first one on scene or if your product or your system is better, maybe you win. If you're in a state where marijuana is legal, then go ahead and drop a comment. Uh, share your experiences, your observations, the challenges for your state, and uh, the challenges for the industry, and um, you know the upsides and the downsides. Love to talk about it.